Have you been thinking of testing out Member Vault as your course hosting platform but don't really know if it is the right option for you? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you the pricing structure and the back end of Member Vault so you can make that decision for yourself. Also, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, click the link below, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell notification. I share tons of marketing tool reviews and also how you can start freelancing in 2020. So let's get into it. Okay, so we are inside the Member Vault dashboard. As you can see, you can customize this link according to your business. So for me, it's shwetadawarconsulting.vipmembervault.com and you have the entire dashboard on the left and then you can start making changes on the right so inside of your dashboard you'll be able to see total engagement of your leads over time or paid customers and you can see their names engagement by product you can see which uh which product has the most engagement you can also see uh engagement for different products and the people who are most engaged so here you're also getting a list of your warm leads so these people have actually checked out other products as well that they're not a part of so you might want to reach out and you know offer them a discount for those particular products then under products is where you will be adding new products so uh, you can add a product here just click add product and you will uh, have status so if it's invisible for now you can do that if you're just building out the product you can also choose whether it's a regular products or a regular means everything will be available to them all at once or if you want to drip it or if you want to make it progressive which means they'll have to complete certain modules in order to go to the next module and you can also have bonuses which will unlock based on engagement scores so the more the person engages the higher their engagement engagement score is going to be so you can use that as well and then you can use a template here uh, generally it's a membership template which is basically something you would use for a course as well and then they are saying that they have more templates coming soon so member world is a relatively new platform and they're constantly improving the platform so it's a great place to start especially you know if you are starting out on a budget so i'll just choose the membership template and then i will click on I will actually add demo product and hit add product. And then now here you'll be able to add modules and within each module you will be able to add lessons. So here you can also add an image that will appear on the sales page of the product. You can have a description which is going to be a sales copy and welcome message when someone signs up. Uh, this is a message they will get and you can personalize it with their first name and email. You can also have uh, a score here if you want this particular course to lock, uh, to lock uh, unlock for someone only after they've reached a certain engagement point. For example, if you're offering a free uh, course and at the end of the free course, uh, you tell them that if you've gone through the whole course, you can unlock a paid course of mine. You can do something like that here. And then you can add modules. So you can, either let it be a teaser module where you're showing them only a part of the paid course you it can be a bonus module or it can be a regular module and then you will give this a title and add module and then each module can have lessons again you can have an image and short description for the module and a longer description and then each lesson could be welcome and you can add a lesson and then within a lesson you can have videos from Vimeo YouTube and then video ID you can have text you can also have files here and you can also add a quiz this is where um, you know member vault is really different first of all you have those engagement points and then you can also add quizzes like multiple choice quiz uh, when are we starting just like an example add question and then you could add multiple options and you could also go ahead and delete it 
So basically, you can go ahead and create all your modules uh, from here. And then within each module, you can have multiple lessons. And then you can also create bonus modules by using bonus module uh, when you go to create a module. And you can also uh, get people to sign up right from member board itself, itself, or you can have a sales page builder like ClickFunnels or lead pages that you're using. And once someone buys it, then you can get them to uh, sign in into member world. So here you can have, you can either provide a link to your sales page. So if someone comes on member world and they want to buy this product, you could send them to a link or you could, uh, you could get them to pay here and then you can set up your payment options right here. Here is where you will attach it to your email service provider. Uh, let's, so let's go into our integrations. So settings, general. You can set up your admin database, uh, admin dashboard and social sharing. This will appear in the footer. And then you have email integration. They're constantly increasing uh, the integrations they have. So email integration, they have payment, they have Stripe, PayPal, and then advanced integrations is where you will use something like Zapier to create webhooks. I generally use, uh, Active campaign, click funnels, and member vault. So I do use webhooks. It's really easy to set up. All you have to do is follow the instructions given there. And then they also have all of these different uh, advanced integrations that you can use. You can also have affiliates for all your products, even if you're on the basic plan. So the basic plan of member vault is free and you can use it up to uh, first 50 members inside your member member vault uh uh back end and then once you're uh over the 50 then it's 39 dollars a month so you can set up your affiliate program right here for each of your products you can look at reports under users you'll be able to see all of your subscribers you can also import subscribers and you can also manually add subscribers so if i want to manually add someone i could just click on add user and add their details and also which products I want to give them access to. And then under users, you'll be also be able to see the engagement scores for each of these people. So you can see someone with a higher engagement score is more engaged. So you can, you know, uh, reach out to those people and get them uh, to buy your product and you can give them discounts. You can also sort by engagement. So easier to figure out who's doing well. So you can see uh, the engagement scores and you can also uh, choose to see people only under a particular product under actions this is basically if someone signs up like what happens right so if someone earns say you know if they earn 100 engagement points uh, you can add them a tag or also send them a notification and this will be your email address. And you, so this notification would basically be that you have uh, earned those many engagement points. You can add them to a different product. So if they reach 100, you could add them to a different product. You could also add a tag to them. And then you could add a name of the tag. So engaged right so you could do all of these things um when they add a product you could add a tag you could do all of these different things for each of the different products uh, and this is under actions and then appearance is where you would uh, create your branding welcome area so you could add your logo title how is it going to look like the design Right, so these are all the different products. Uh, you could choose the colors here and Favicon. You could also edit your welcome area. So you could choose to show it or not show it. Announcement bar is basically what appears at right at the top. So if I say get a discount or something so this is how it's going to appear right here and then you can of course choose your colors and then you can also edit your footer 
So if you want to show what other products are available, you can show them in the footer. You can add your social uh, links and you can also remove Powered by Member Vault. This is a very new feature that they've added. And you can also preview your account here. So this is how it's going to look like when someone logs in. I know it. it is, I still have to uh, customize the images and make them coherent, but this is how it's going to look like. And then you see a social, this is the website, and this is where uh, you can change your colors and your logo and they'll be able to see available products and their own products. So this is basically how Member Vault is. I think it is a great platform to get started with if you are looking for that free platform, easy platform, and also something that gives you an option to have affiliates for your products. Again, if this is something you're interested in, check the link below, go ahead and sign up and uh, tell me how it goes. Let me know if this works for you. Also, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, do so right now. I create some awesome videos around marketing tools. And I also talk about how you can start your own online business, whether you're working full time or you're working part time or you're looking to take your business full time. So I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.